Anyway, we've got t t day <laughs> today. Four, four, four. Let's we'll call him T day. Rival. Yep. We've got both these players stepping up onto the stream. Hopefully, we'll be able to find something from both of them as we move on. See, Rival plays Z ZSS still, right? In this game? I. Yeah, uh, you are correct. And we got today on the Dr. Mario. It's been a long time since I've seen Doc. I've seen Luis do some stuff with him at North Cal, so I'm excited to see what today's got. I got high expectations, man. For Doc? Mm -hmm. I got high expectations for him. Character's not great. Oh, okay, this character has an insane combo game. Dr. Mario? Yeah. I mean, he's, he's got the he's got the potential for it, but right now it's just his down special is really good for edge guarding potential. He's got confirms into it, which makes him a pretty strong character, and he hits pretty hard in the up tilts. He knew that he would, the second the third one wasn't true, so he went for the shield attempt, thinking he would get something down. But yeah, but rival just using that uh, uh, down B to get out of that combo. Yep, unable to find it. Great tech away, but 51 percent. He's looking for these zares quite a lot, but today is not even phased by it. Throwing out these throwing out these pills. It's left an interesting and right. interaction there with the the pills and the and the tether grab there. <laughs> Both kind of they just kind of just beat each other, or they just trade with each other. Yeah, they cancel each other out, but the pills gonna be about to get out today. Getting comboed up a little bit, but rival unable to continue the chain. He's gonna be able to use these. Uh, okay, T Day had that read there, but he didn't run far enough. But of course. Dr. Mario is pretty slow, so maybe that wasn't even true. And the up yeah, shield, not going to kill just yet at all. Dr. Mario is a little beefier of a character, but the back air forcing Rival off stage once yeah, it more. Looks like maybe Rival is trying to parry it, or he just dropped shield just a little early, sending him off stage. But DSS have amazing options off stage with that. Ooh. Went for a pill and confirm. he's just dead. No, he's going to be making it oh, back. He just barely made it. Okay, yeah, he didn't have that down B anymore, mm -hmm. but. Could just barely make it yeah, out. you don't need it at all. No pill confirmed. A little too high of a percent to do that. So a lot of Zares coming in, but it just takes one back from Dr. Marsh to really take that. And he's unable to find it because that distance jab comes insanely fast. And there we go, taking it rival. Just like that. All right, rival. And th this is where Ooh. we tend to see. I was going to say this is where we tend to see the top top players just really excel is when they run away with these kinds of leads. But right now it's even again. So. Uh -huh. Uh, your Dr. Mario is not disappointing. Yeah. He's going to get comboed up easily. That up air, up air into the back air as well today. 61% already on him, but he just needs a few. He just needs to land a few good hits in. I mean, North Cal calls Dr. Mario the mini Ganon for a reason because he just needs to land a few more and he let them strong hits in order to find a stock. But Rival's doing a really good job calling out everything, but the up B actually misses though. And oh, actually. Nice up smash calling up this. Down B, you know you're you're smoking when you're calling out those down Bs against a ZSS player. Mm -hmm. That flip tip could be caught out the back throw does force him off stage though. So today recovering successful. This time using the pill and the nair to cover up the shield, but rival forcing him in a comfortable position. He's at 80 percent, but Dr. Mario's got some insane kill power. Got yeah, T landing these pin pills, but he's just not in a position to get the confirms off them. On him to find a follow up, and that and that flip kick from Rival is able to get him out into. It's a jail, it's a get out of jail free card for any disadvantaged state he's in. If he's pinched right, in the corner, yeah. flip kick, right? And Dr. Mario can't really follow up with it, and that side force could be forced out today. Learn his lesson from previously, but, but he can't punish it. Yeah, but TJ called that other one out with the up smash, so he's shown that he can do it. I think, which is really important. In oh! But a great job by Rival using that boost kick in order to take out the stock, just like that T-Day. He needs to find some way in order to get in, and he oh, knew. Oh, smash out of shield. He knew that was an option. That jab does come out really fast, but the end lag frames are not something to be laughing oh, about. the grab? Okay. Wow, CS is just so easily escaping these combos. Yeah, he's really abusing the flip kick. He knows that T-Day can't really follow up. And actually, the trip leads into a little more damage as well, so 54%. On the ZSS in the back air, gonna take a little more damage as well. Flip kick gonna be red out, dodging off the fair as well. They're both gonna collide with that. Two options of punish there, but didn't. Oh, okay. T Day in a bad spot. He's got to use the down B, and he's gonna make it back. Okay. Just barely, he's able to use that tornado to get by himself back, and the pill confirming that the up air does force right back off stage. That was really unsafe there, and T Day almost. <laughs> almost had that. Oh, he like, called it out. Was that a Tomahawk into down special? That's yeah, not going to kill just yet. Kill. Okay, CSS light, but 
still. He's able to mash out oh, just barely. Put himself. And that down. Know, did he just put himself in the wrong spot? I don't know, but it's a lot of things coming in right now. This is such a close match. Percents are evened up, and both of them have really strong kill power. CSS is going to be looking at those fairs. He just needs to wall him oh, out. Okay, he He's didn't get the second hit of that. He's going to live here. He's still got to jump, trying to use that down there okay. as well. There, just so crazy risky. That hitbox is out for a while. Mm -hmm. He's going to look for an option. Right now, t is going to go ahead and use his pill shot, find some way, and he's oh. looking for a grab. He knows it will end he it. He could have upbeat right there, but that requires the reactions of a god. And he tried to read that tech. You're going to force away, jumping away from that okay, side special. Tech? No, uh, no tech chase there from the Oh, pill. no. Oh, Jesus. Another just up be above the ledge, not getting punished. It's a missed T -Day. opportunity. Great tech from T-Day in order to get away from that situation. But rival, both of them living oh, with the up smash. The last hitbox. Who's coming in to punish it? Does catch him out. He, yeah. Does catch him out for that last pit of the up smash. Air dodged behind him, and I think then gone for maybe like a back throw. I'm not sure if that would have killed though. Mm -hmm. But is able to find it. So really close match between these between rival and T Day. So hopefully, hopefully T Day will able to come back from this one. He did a really impressive job using that Dr. Mario was able to get those tornadoes, but it was the fact that he was unable to kill the few options that he had, but. I mean, what goes, what goes. All right, yeah, Rival adjusting his stuff. He knows you gotta he's do gonna what you gotta have do. to. What? You gotta do what you gotta do, man. Well, he knows he's gonna have to get his head in the game if he wants to take out this Dr. Mario player. Because yeah, T-Day came to play. Oh yeah, he did. Right now, he's asserting his mental, mental stuff right now. Hopefully able to come back swinging in this one, but we have a headset not working? Yeah, we got that sound. So hopefully we get that fixed up real fast. That's T Day on that Dr. Mario. Back onto it, no character swaps just yet. It's a rival. Stick it to the dog. Stick it to what you know. And Zero Suit gonna be picked up by Rival. So round number two of this set. Coming in right now. Three, two, one. So here Go. comes the rematch between these two. Okay, going back to Pokemon Stadium. Pokemon Stadium 2, it's a really reliable stage, and he goes with the down throw, trying to extend it with the up tilt, but that flip kick just gets Rival out of these, all these bad situations. He's really abusing it. Yeah, I mean, to see, uh, I don't and know what I was going to say. Okay. I mean, he's able to use these options out. He's able to really use, use it. But right now, it's going to be an aerial battle. Pill, point Pill. blank. That's not the option he definitely would have wanted. not what he was intending to do there. Okay, even with the parry, he's unable to punish that. Yeah, he's doing CSS's down B is just such a good move. Yeah, he's doing the best as he can, trying to find some way. He's trying to use that tornado as well, but unable yeah, to find I it. Like he waited to the end to rise with it. Yeah, T-Day gonna get oh, ran out. That's gonna kill. Yep. Oh no. Not looking Down too smash, good. Also a really good move. Yeah, not looking too good right now. Up smash, up smash does force Rival off stage, so okay, hope he's gonna look I love for these, this pill coverage off stage. But uh, Rival finding his way around them. Yeah, he's able to find some way around it, but T-Day just needs to find just one strong move in order to get this down back are going to be used on shield he's going to use it off stage that very beginning of the hitbox bailing rival out from that pill pill from i think if today landed a back arrow that would have been the stop on the have to find it just yet flip kick here misses here flip kick back onto the stage going to make him easily get back onto the center but t-day looking for something in the back air not unable to take it just yet Oh, he's looking for something. He's really fishing for it. 154. Yes, this is living so he hard. Still hasn't taken damage at this point, so this is definitely doable. Yeah, this is really good for him. Just does need does not oh, want to get touched at go all. For a tornado here, just to try to catch one of these jumps that Rival's making up in the corner. Yeah, and trying to get that pilgrim from down down there does miss out. Tina's doing such a good job, making sure he doesn't take any damage whatsoever. So good on him. Dash tag gonna be whipping out once more. He's trying to keep oh, it back. Oh, just to keep it. Nice. Yeah, okay, unable to find yeah. it. Unable to find it just yet in it's back air. So, it's so hard for Dr. Mario to, to, to find a straight hit when Rival is playing like this because uh, Dr. Mario is just so slow. Yeah, he's finally able to up. He had a shield. Not getting the sweet spot. 
Yeah, it's not looking too good right now. Tide did such a good job, but it's only inevitable that he's going to take damage right now. My goodness. Oh, platform. Oh, no. Again, Dr. Mario is just so slow. Unable to he find. Cover that platform. Yeah, unable to find a tech chase. So 36% already. 41 as I speak. Rival 195. He should not be living at these high percents in the up here. Okay, finally takes. Finally takes with an up air. Very smart. Uh, Mario, Dr. Mario not having a lot of great approach options, but that just coming out just enough in front of him to threaten that and take that stock. Yeah, he's able to get out of that bad situation. And right now that back air forcing out, including with the F-Tilt as a combo. Great job using that Nair to catch out the flip kick, but no follow-up on that parry, unfortunately. Doc is just really struggling against this matchup, and here comes the berry into the up smash. It seems like that, but this is not that... Uh, that I mean, this is still very close. Mm -hmm. It's not impossible just yet, and that could be a hard punish down throw. He's trying to read the option now, but unable to find anything else. That pill does land. Here come the mind games right now. Both them pressing each other's shield with these aerials, and he does oh, land the confirm. That's gonna yes, kill. That's gonna kill. And T Day is on top. I told you, man, don't count this stock out. And but the up at added shield, gonna force him out into his awkward position. Rival looking for an edge guard attempt, but yeah, goes deep with the side B, but it's still pretty a low commitment. Edge guard from CSS is able to get there back first. He's able to get back onto the stage. That bear gonna call out that pill, and here comes the up air. But TD unable to chain it into anything else, unfortunately. But he does dodge out that side special. He's able to get away with it with the skin of his teeth. But these stairs coming in, he calls it out, but the oh, up but he misses. misses with the up B. That's huge. That's so huge. See how much damage TD is able to put on as a result of this. Or maybe he'll even close out this stock with all this rage. Trying to look for an option right now. Great parry into the jab. Right. What more can he get off of this? Rival feeling the pressure right now. The back air doesn't sweet spot. Thankfully for him, he's going to stay alive. And great parry as well into the jab, knowing that's his fastest option. That's the best he's got. Another oh, parry. Get him out. Of oh, no. <laughs> I wanted to see that back throw. I nah, love that back throw. Back throw dude. won't kill at this percent. But it'll get him off stage. I guess ZSS has a pretty good time getting back, though. So. T Day. He's got a download on Rival is doing a really good job. Completely running up, but oh. drops his shield, unfortunately. Yeah, those multi-hits, sometimes it's hard to know how long they stay out. And T Day, unfortunately, getting hit by that. Yeah, but he's got the lead right now as soon as they speak that. Give him a little percent off, but Rival. Can Rival find that one hit that he needs to close out the set? I mean, it should be T Day is looking for that one hit. And looking for it. Use Bears out. A lot of respect coming in from T Day, knowing that these fairs are such a dominating presence in this matchup. And the Xander gonna be used up flip kick to get him back out of that disadvantage state. It's so good. T Day really respecting this potential damage, and here comes the up airs. Lift flip oh, kick into nice. the cancel. Sweet. Oh my goodness. Okay, and up air sending him back out stage. Alright. And the Whatever and you say, Sakurai. He is able to get something down right now. It's those leaking hitboxes that can mean anything, and here comes the Zare. He okay, went for the tries heart. to call him out. Finally gets that one tornado. Yep, he's able to do so much right now. T Day finally takes that matchup, but that was super close. Two close games. We're going to game three, guys. Mm -hmm. Rival taking the first one and T Day taking the second. Really close stuff from both these players, though. <laughs> T Day just shaking his head. Man, that was close. Uh -huh. I mean, it was. Like, the first game was close as well. It was like last stock, last hit. And then T-Day versus Rival on the second one. T-Day was really controlling the match super well. Rival had had the lead at first, but T-Day was able to really just do so much work on that Dr. Mario. So hopefully, we'll be able to move on to the third game, the final game, to see who will stay on the winner's side. And Dr. Mario can be picked up once more. Here we go again. <laughs> That's it. Sign coming out from T-Day. All right, game three, and it's on everyone's favorite stage, Yggdrasil's Altar. And we've got some nice music playing out right now. Dragon's Quest got some great OST. Let me tell you that right now. Just to tell you that straight out of here. And here come the pills right now. TD switching up his game style, game plan. I like that. His pair's coming in, but that flip kick does force him in this really good situation. He's getting that damage off. But TD, this is a lot more defensive than I'm used to. All right, yeah. Doesn't seem to be working out that well for him, though. He's already, he's taking a lot of damage here, and not any, a lot of these pills. Oh, are no. Hard. Already at this percentage is T-Day. It's, it's not looking make too Make a big hill for him to climb. Yeah, it's not looking too good. Rival able to get those hard reads down, really forcing the fact that Dr. Mario can't get these recovery potions down. He's I mean, actually... He had the read, but he doubted himself right there. Mm -hmm. And here comes the Zare. No up yet out of that one, though. He's going to use the falling Nair as well, but T-Day... 
Oh, uh, it's not looking too good for him right now. 51% already. I remember he has a stock down. Rival doing so well. He's able to really read what TD is doing and catch up with the down smash. And here comes the edge guard. Completely different game. This is an entirely different rival that we're seeing trying to read that role. Playing so patient, but the up smash does come out for a little more damage. But TD's got such a big hill to climb. Yeah, I mean, are we going to see another up B here from, from Rival? That's all he needs at the edge of the stage. I mean, this, but he's, his run back, F tilt, just make T Day's life and frustrating and goes for a huge edge guard here. And that's going to be. Mario it. Can nope. still make it back. Oh, he can. I, thought, I didn't yeah. think he'd saved his jump that entire yeah, I time. I didn't know either, but with his jump, he can make it. Yep, and here you're going to get the confirm reading but the DI perfectly. Yeah, still not going to quite take it. Uh, okay. <laughs> Rival doing some crazy alter shenanigans, recovering almost from the center of the stage there. Yeah, gonna be able to get it back right now. Oh no, that could have been a punish. That get up attack hit him on the shield, but nope, nothing out of that yet. So T Day forced off stage once more. Great read on the roll. Yeah, unfortunately CSS. Oh, is not off that and a reversal. Rival just extends a little too much off stage, and T Day hits him with the tornado. I don't know what he was doing that far out. Yeah, he tried to go for that hard reading in the side special, but T-Day weaving around it. Gonna use that turn to secure the kill, but down smash will lead into the boost kick, so that's gonna be easy kill, yeah, Rival. That's a, that's a definite kill. Rival with such a commanding lead, and here comes the throw forward, throw forcing in this uncomfortable position, but here comes the combo. Okay, goes, I, I don't know, maybe that was an air dodge read or something? He went for something, but unable to find anything. T-Day doing such a good job. I mean, you're not getting that spike hit box anyway, so it's, it's only just a little more damage. Yeah, he's doing there. such a good job. He actually air dodges away, really fearing it out, but the back air eats up the pill and the attack as well, so T-Day forced in a really uncomfortable position. Uh, so, so uh -oh. tense for T-Day right here. Yeah, really bad situation for him. Dan is in a situation where he cannot get hit here. And he is getting hit as much as he, he tries to prevent it, but Rival is just running right over him and using that Nair. It's so safe. I mean, Doc is one of those characters that dies earlier because you can't recover from certain parts of the blast zone when yep. you get out too far. It's the recovery hasn't been the issue, is that Rival has been so on point with these down smashes That's into true. the up he confirms. Oh. That's going to be And it. a groan of pain from T-Day as that down smash closes out the set. Rival missed one of the down smashes there into the up B. 